Money, money, money. We all need it and want more of it. If you think about it, gone are the days of paper bills and coins and putting them in a piggy bank and some envelopes. Like, that's so old school. Senator Steve Swardzinski of Eden Prairie is backing a bill that would require students in Minnesota take a personal finance course before graduation. I kind of think, like, it's about time. I mean, it seems like that should be a very basic thing that we should teach our kids in school. Greg Merced, a certified financial planner, says it's important for students to learn the fundamentals of banking, budgeting, and building credit. But he says legislation won't solve all the problems. It's a good first step, but I think it's a little too late in the game, okay? I think kids need to be taught this stuff much earlier, like elementary school, middle school. A recent study conducted by the nonprofit NextGen Financial showed about 5% of high school students in the state are required to take a standalone personal finance course to graduate. It also revealed Minnesota earned a C in teaching kids personal finance. C's get degrees, but that doesn't mean that you're really good at something. I hope that parents don't kind of uh, think that they can just outsource this uh, ability to teach their kids about working and money. It's never going to happen. Nobody's going to be able to do it as good as you can do it. He says coupled with technology, parents can help their kids learn. He created an app called Busy Kid. I like to describe Busy Kid as um, your kid's first job with direct deposit. You give your kids chores to do, okay? They do them, they mark them off on their app, and our system keeps track of that. And then every Thursday, we're going to send you a message as a parent that says, Johnny earned $20 this week. Do you want to pay him, yes or no? If you think about it, that's exactly what we do as adults. We go to work, we earn some money, we put some money in like a 401k or something and save it. We share with church or charity something we care about, and then we spend the rest. Teaching kids early about money works. I've got six of them, okay? Three of them have left the nest, and when they've left, they've had thousands and thousands of dollars saved up. And that's not because, like, I'm rich and I give them all this money. It's because they learned work ethic early and they start and they learned a balanced approach.